Welcome back. This is Rich again, back for another exclusive YouTube video blog. And this YouTube video blog will be about um, retail stores. Why are they dying and how could everybody could save them? But first, this message of interest. Don't forget to listen to Crystal's Time Machine each and every Friday and Saturday night from 9 to 11 p.m. on WCAP 980, where everybody gets it. If you can't catch the show live, listen to podcasts exclusively on archive.org. Goes back to October 2015. Follow Crystal on Twitter at Crystal Amy John and Machine Crystal. Follow her on Instagram, Crystal Johnson. Follow her on Facebook, the official Crystal's Time Machine Facebook page, the official Crystal's Time Machine group page, and Game Show fan page. And subscribe to our YouTube channel, one exclusive um, YouTube video a week. And if you're going to blow Massachusetts and order at Broadway Pizza, Leah, in um, the official sponsor of Crystal's Time Machine, and mention Crystal's Time Machine, you get a $2 discount. So that is good, especially when prices continue to go up and up and up. And now, back to our video blog subject. Okay, the retail business in the United States of America for the past several years has been hit hard with the sales um, um, the sales of retail items going via online, like Amazon.com, Overstock.com, Walmart.com, Target.com, etc. And with all of these um, websites um, selling stuff and mailing them to your house, a lot of people aren't going to the stores to shop around like they used to be. A lot of people just maybe shop at a retail store or a clothing store just to um, look at one price and then they might go to another store and look at another price and then they compare these prices and they go um, to Amazon.com and see how much that's worth and a lot of times it's usually lower than what they're selling it at the store, which it's not good for the store at all. It's good for Amazon.com, but it's not good for these retail stores because if you're not buying their merchandise, these, these merchandise sits on the shelves for weeks or months. Sometimes stores can't even sell retail merchandise, so they put it on clearance and they some people buy at 60, 70, 80 percent off. And that's not really good because of the prices. They should sell it at the best price possible with the with these stuff. And COVID-19 shut a lot of these stores down for several months. And when they reopened, they reopened with limited um, hours and limited staff. And it got a lot more people just to shop online. And with, with eventually everything get, getting back to normal stores, are hurting left and right. Um, there's hardly any Kmart and Sears stores anymore. Jade C. Penny and Macy's are closing stores left and right. A lot of even discount stores like Bed Bath and Beyond and Christmas tree shops had to 
file for chapter 11, eventually chapter 7, and even some Dollar Tree stores and Dollar General stores and Family Dollar stores are shutting some of its location down because people aren't shopping in the stores. And with more and more retail business is going down the wayside. Shopping malls and shopping centers are dying a slow death. And it's not good at all because there could be a possibility where most, if not all, shopping malls in the United States are extinct in 10 to 20 years. And also a lot of shopping centers and plazas might get tough time getting new tenants around. They might have like other anchor stores that probably are surviving it, like not like Walmart and Target and Kohl's, but um, other s smaller stores might not really you know survive. And the only way people could save the retail industry from going almost exclusively online is to shop at the stores and buy stuff at the stores. And if you buy stuff at the stores, the stores are very happy when you, you know, buy them. And because that keeps people's jobs and you and people really need jobs today. Also shopping at a store is a sense of um, community and, you know, it's helping out your local business if it's a local business. Also, uh, small businesses really depend on you shop um, at stores without buying any of their products online because small businesses um, really help the economy. Plus, Many large retail chains in um, the pe past, present, and maybe in the future started as a small local business. So just um, just shop at your at any retail stores right now because they really really need your business. Just don't go, go in there and just browse around and comparing prices and going to shop on Amazon.com or Overstock.com or eBay or whatever these retail um, websites like um, Target.com, Walmart.com because sometimes if you buy an item, it might not be the right size or it might not be um, the right um, color if it's a clothing or it might not even come. So please save the retail industry. Shop at your local or your favorite national chain store. They really need the business right now. And thank you for all your support. Uh, message me on the comment section. Bye now.